Well, hello everybody, it's Dave Burkus for Insights from Burkonomics. Today's subject, you are your company's moral compass. Here's a story that you may identify with or have yet to experience in your business life. It's one of those that define your leadership for all of those to see, sometimes based upon decisions made in the very moment, such as the one I'm about to tell about. Here's the story of a CEO snap judgment call. It was mine. Years ago, when I was CEO of a record manufacturing company in Hollywood, I happened to walk around the plant into the press room just as Bobby, one of the employee's favorite co-workers, was offering stolen merchandise to his fellow pressman from a bag he was carrying. He hauled it and waited for me to react, obviously caught in the act. Everyone loved Bobby. He was a hard worker and a good friend. But I fired him on the spot the only possible response to the situation presented to me so suddenly. After initial shock, a number of employees came to me that day and said that they understood how hard that decision was, but they knew it was the right thing to do. Well, how do your decisions affect your company? Hmm. You'll find that many times during your management years, when your decisions are placed before you, you have a real responsibility requiring quick, unwavering response to an ethical challenge to you or your company. How you comport yourself in those situations is absolutely the litmus test for how your company culture will reflect your actions. Take home company supplies for personal use, your employees will surely follow your lead no matter what the policy. Treat personal expense at company cost and your salespeople will feel just fine doing the same until they're caught. Behave without regard for an individual's dignity when separating an employee who's a direct report and other managers will feel little compunction to spend their extra time and energy softening their actions. Alter any accounting result for the sake of making a month look good and your accounting department will get the message that gap accounting is just for show. It is the difficult decisions that define your leadership. It's not easy to always be the moral compass for the organization but it is the right thing and cannot be compromised. And you will continue to enjoy the stories of times taking the right and high road as retold to you by your employees over time. Well, I've written lots of books and you'll find them on amazon.com. I'd appreciate it if you'd take a chance to look and perhaps buy one of these books. All of them have these kinds of stories. In fact, there are hundreds of these kinds of stories that I tell in these books. Well, it's Dave Burkus for Insights from Burkonomics. See you next time.